First question, have you always lived here in Rome? Uh, with the exception of the four years I was away at college. Okay. Um, well, how'd your family end up here in Rome? Uh, mother's family has been here three generations. Uh, my dad's family is actually from the Calhoun area, and they migrated from the Carolinas and then before that, England. So okay. that's, but that's several generations right, back. Right. Um, mom's family is a combination of English, Irish, German, and they were early 1800s. Okay. They all migrated this way. Okay, gotcha. All righty. Um, <clears throat> I'm currently um, not from Rome either, so I'm originally from a super small town in Alabama. Uh, to this day, we don't have a traffic lot. <laughs> um and but right now, um, I reside over in Somerville. That's where my husband's from. Um, and we rent our home, and it's a, a brick home kind of ranch style house. Would you mind telling me a little bit about what type of home you live in? I rent a two bedroom apartment. That is townhouse style. Um, not exactly sure of the square footage, but it is in a gated complex. Um, not much to tell about it. It's brick structure, uh, two floors, two bed, two bedrooms, two and a half baths. Decent size place. Okay. Uh, do you have rooftop solar for your home? No. Okay. Um, why do you not have rooftop solar? Did you make that decision, or was that something that was made for you? An apartment, so yes, it's made for me. Okay. Um, um would you, if it was available, would you want solar? I would have to look at the cost options, possibly. Uh, we'll just have to weigh out the pros and cons and cost benefit. You know, okay. when would it, how long does it take to kind of pay itself to where you're actually saving money and so forth? Okay. All righty. Now, we're going to kind of switch gears just a little bit. Um, Let's see. Here's a map of the United States. You've got a pen there. Um, where do you think people have the most rooftop solar energy on their homes? And could you just kind of draw that on the map for me? Ooh, I'm kind of between a couple places. I'm going to go out on a limb and say Florida. But I could be completely wrong. I just have no idea. That. Okay. All right. Um, what makes that community so different from people here in Rome? Um, I'm not necessarily thinking it would be a different community. It just seems like it would be a much more viable option there, more sunlight, um, maybe a little bit more progressive. Okay. All righty. Now, you know, we're going to talk about people here in Georgia. Georgia. Um, so, uh, in what community here in Georgia do you think people have the most rooftop solar? Mm -hmm. That's interesting. I'm going to go, like when you say community, one county in particular or it can be a, an area. a general area, I'm going to say kind of east of Atlanta towards Athens, maybe that, that kind of general area. Okay. All right. So kind of east of, it, east, mm -hmm. of east of Athens there. Um so, tell me why you think people in that area have the most rooftop solar. Uh, a couple reasons. One, um, several affluent communities in that area, very progressive area, especially the Athens area. Um, I think more people with that could afford to do the panels and progressive enough to see the benefits of it as opposed to other forms of energy. Okay. What about most of your close friends here in Georgia? Do they have solar on their roof? None that I'm aware of. Okay. Why do you think they don't? Probably just simply because the cost of actually setting it up and probably don't see the benefits of it. Okay. Or understand the benefits of it. Maybe that would be a better way of putting it. Okay. Well, all righty. Is there anything else you'd like to add? No. Okay. All right.